All right, guess what time it is. It's time for an H3 VR update. It's the new year. Uh, the first real H3 VR video, I think. <laughs> I don't know. My uh, schedule's been a little bit busy with all these uh, new games coming out like uh, Resident Evil and Ace Combat 7. But I get some time to play some, Ace, uh, some H3 VR. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, if you didn't know or didn't watch the devlog, uh, Anton has made some progress with the uh, melee weapons, so I think um, if I heard him correctly, I think a lot of them are now uh, working. So a lot of the melee weapons here. Uh, there is one that I would like to test later on, but uh, for right now, let's just check this out. Oh, there's the flamethrower. I haven't played with this thing in a long time. Let's uh, forgot how to use it. Oh, yeah, that's right. The, uh, wider, yeah. yeah, I mean, um, it's a flamethrower. What do you want? <laughs> Pick that there. <laughs> All right. So let's see what we got on the table here. We got screwdrivers, uh, one of these uh, packing knives or whatever they use to um, open boxes and other stuff. Ooh, it's a, oh, crowbar, it's a hatchet, cool stuff, uh, this is a big fire axe, two-handed, hopefully, well, actually, hold on, <laughs> I'm left-handed, so, that, <laughs> hopefully I'm not hitting anything in real life. Two-handed. All right. Uh, we got a machete. Which, uh, yeah, there you go. Good for cutting down jungle brush. Little pickaxe. Stuff. A bat with a saw on it. Cool. Cool. <laughs> Hopefully, I'm not hitting anything. Oh man, it's gonna be pretty bad if I hit the wall. And all the assorted uh, knives that uh, are in the game. It's a wonderful one right there. Very tactical looking one. Or, uh, Rambo style. That's uh, uh, it's a bayonet pretty much, but uh, there's no bayonets. Little K-bar. Uh, I forgot what these are called. <laughs> they're in, rain they're in uh, Counter Strike, that's it. Cool. And uh, Kukri. Axe. I mean, just a lot of weapons here. A lot of farm implements. Um, ooh. And some new broadswords, if I remember correctly. I think they're called broadswords. I'm not too sure about my swords. I know a decent amount about firearms, but not much about bladed weapons or anything like that. So, don't quote me on that. Anyways. Let's spawn some sausage. I'm just gonna test this out, actually. Okay. Got some of this new stuff here. Um, let's see. Little, uh... Okay, cool. And uh, I'm familiar with a machete. We live in a jungle environment for a long time. Learn how to use them. <laughs> Especially if you live on an island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. You you get really uh get really acquainted with a machete. Good for uh cutting down brush. Uh let's see what else. Uh, big two handed weapon. Oh, I'll take the axe. Well, yeah, check that out. And uh for all you classic Half Life fans out there, it's a crowbar. I'm gonna put you over here. There we go. All right, loaded for bear, and uh, you can see all the previous weapons uh, here, especially that pencil. I'm not gonna use because we're talking about new weapons today. Well, the old weapons that have been uh, made to work with the new system. Oh, got uh, a couple dancing over there. Got another one. All right. 
go to work. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, with these new weapons. Uh, explode now, please. Thank you. Okay. With these new weapons, you can uh, actually stab things now. It's um, cool. Before, it was just those weapons on the table. These ones. And uh, from what I... From what I saw on the devlog, I think that these weapons actually work the intended way in uh, a lot of various modes now. So, like um, Return of the Rot Wieners or anything that has sausages. So hopefully, I'm going to try some of that a little later. But yeah, now you can stab with them. Stuff. You now get a screwdriver out. Punch it into the neck. And then... Oh, <laughs> Do a little uh, brutal kill. Oh, oh, yep, yeah, that's a bug. I forgot that happens. Because <laughs> if you uh, stab into the uh, sausage and then if it's holstered or um, tethered to your uh, belt slot, they'll just uh, transport with you, like so. Oh, wait. I didn't do that one. Oh well, he's just gonna have a screwdriver in his neck. Oh, he's, yeah. Yeah, I'll go. I'll, I'll I'll do a good example right here. Let's try someone who hasn't been uh, damaged yet. Grab them, and they're uh, yeah, they're locked onto your body, like little trophies. You know, you just get off. Thank you. All right. So uh, what else? Got the little uh, package opener here. Yeah, you work it at a distribution center. Some heavily armored dudes uh, invade your space. You know, for some reason. I don't know why they would do that, but maybe they there's an important package they have to get. But you're the only one in there that has to uh, defend all these packages from these uh, enemies, right? You grab your uh, little box cutter here. Oh, now he's stuck to me. <laughs> I forgot that was a, yeah. You know, there was a, there's a lanyard there, one of those like retractable ones with the uh, little uh, mechanism that goes zoop. <laughs> you stab him and he didn't. You let go and it comes back to you. I don't know. I'm just making stuff up at this point. Uh, 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 uh. Yep. And then uh, you get the. K bar style. Not this is an actual model of the K bar, but you now there you go. Be like um, grizzled veteran. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, <laughs> I forgot that was a uh, holstered onto me. There's, uh, you know, attached to me. All right, let's drop that. Let's drop these. I don't need these anymore. Oh, can you throw these? Oh. Gotta be a way to <laughs> knock them out. All right, let's try the uh, crowbar. Let's drop this thing. And you should, yeah, there we go. Now they get kind of stuck on uh, these pointed weapons. Still alive? No, you're dead. I wonder if I can uh, hit them with the uh, other end here. See if that's modeled. Boom! Oh, no. Yep. Well, no, that didn't work. Oh, no. This is only a one handed weapon, huh? Oh! I keep forgetting that these are. Uh, these are technically uh, attached to me. There we go. Now let's try some uh, decapitations. The fire axe. Hopefully I don't hit anything. And make sure that this is the uh, edge of my play space. Okay. Oh. No, I'm stuck. <laughs> there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Something people don't know is if you uh, have a two-handed weapon, you do more damage by holding it with two hands. Obviously it's a little awkward, but uh, yeah. Go. 
Because, you know, you swing it with one hand, it, it does damage, but it doesn't do as much damage as doing it two-handed. So, let me, just, uh, let me just line up my swing here. Uh, you know what? Before I do anything, I want to make sure there's it's the edge of my space. The edge of my space. I want to get a good, nice swing on this guy. Chopping down a tree. Except he's a uh, humanoid sausage. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, there we go. That's a good feeling. Uh, very weird, but feels good, I guess. <laughs> All right, let's try some other uh, weapons here. The pickaxe. This is a two-handed weapon as well, so get this uh, easily lodged into something. Most likely these uh, sausages. Oh nope, I didn't. Just uh, did some blunt damage there. Well, you know, I'm just gonna one-hand it. Oh, there we go. Have that. That's yours. Whoops. Oh. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Didn't mean to kill you there. Well, you know, that was my intention. Uh, little tippy taps on the face. Oh. <laughs> oh, I hit the armor. Oh, well, it's there forever. That's all right. That's good. What else can I use here? Okay, uh, got a little hatchet. Got some knives that uh, I'm not really using. Maybe the baseball bat. Huh. Try to. Uh, that's what I do. There we go. Two handed. Now you can have the uh, blunt damage. Just, uh, oh, I hit my controllers together. What I hate about VR, I can't see everything in the outside world. And then you've got the little blade there. The cap fits. Ooh, nice. Instantaneous. The little uh, Negan from uh, The Walking Dead. Or, uh, except if they had got helmets, you yeah. meet. <laughs> Here we go. Oh! <laughs> Whoa, I missed. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, oh serious? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this guy still got the pickaxe in him. All right. Well, you know what? Cool. Let's drop that. And yeah, pretty much. It's just you know, I think. Uh, Oh yeah, I forgot about the uh, farm implements too. Here's the rake. Now you gotta clean up the area, you know. Just, uh, oh. I just hate that. You know, you're trying to clean up, but uh, the little saucing heads get stuck on your uh, rake. You know? yep. There, you know, just uh, you know what? I need a pitchfork. We have a pitchfork. No, we don't. <laughs> Well, that would have been nice if we had a pitchfork. Actually, uh, like I said, he, Anton said that the um, most of the melee weapons were um, fixed. So I wonder if this will work. Oh yeah, they do. Okay. All right. Now I just uh, we're going to uh, we're going to clean up today. Pick up these. Uh, Oh, that was a uh, that was a part of my wall there. <laughs> huh? That's kind of strange. I don't know where to. You... Hmm. I wish it would. Mo I wish it would be more like this. I have to twist my controller around, and I'm now at a weird angle. I want to, you know, scoop, but it, you, when you grab it, it. it 
orients itself like face down, which is kind of weird, but whatever, you know, I'm gonna clean up here. Grab these babies. Get off. Got a couple of, uh, whoop. Can't quite get. Yeah, yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh. oh no. Oh no. No. Oh. Oh no, <laughs> this is not going too well. Oh wait, you're still alive. That's right. <laughs> Just use the blunt end. Whoa, that's kind of weird. Oh wait, yeah, that's right. Yeah, okay. That's uh, my controller was floating like all the way out here, but that's the second grab point. You can pretty much like angle it. Now my controller is pretty much vertical like this. I was just wondering why that was like that. Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, one of the things that uh, Anton showed off is now that you can throw the shovel. Kind of, you know, kind of strange. Again, I'm not so sure how to do it because I think you know. I mean, when I think of trying to throw a shovel. You know, I want to do it like this, right? But then my controller is like this, so now I'm holding the shovel like this. Oh, you know, I don't even know what I'm doing. Hold on. Where is it? There's an option here. Or, yes, there we go. So see how I'm holding the controller? Yeah, I want to throw it. I don't exactly know how they do it, but I think it's no. Nope, see, it spawns like that. That's so weird. Because I want to hold the controller like this, so when I could throw it, you know, or like this, you know. So I'm throwing it like a javelin, but instead I'm just like underhand throwing this thing, which is kind of weird. Now come back here. Oh, I spawned this. There we go. Now I can uh, spawn multiple shovels and just, uh, I guess, underhand throw them. Give me. <laughs> here, come on. <laughs> this is so. Cool. Shovels everywhere. Oh, I think I got two of them stuck in them. I guess, I mean, it automatically corrects itself when you let go, so... Yeah, I can just... Throw them like that. Yeah. it! Hit it! Come on, give me some more shovels. Hoop. Hoop. Oh, <laughs> they hit each other. Oh, that's fun. Oh, wow, that's exhausting. But yeah, you know, so now you can uh, throw shovels. Like in Far Cry. <laughs> that's where that's from. Oh, nope, you're supposed to fly off. There we go. Yeah, grab them and then throw them like that. Oh. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> oh, I missed. <laughs> well, that's enough of that. Let me see what else is there. Some other farm implements. We got a, uh, we got a hoe. <laughs> I don't, know, I don't know how you can explain that, but that's a, that's a hoe. You know, you dig in the ground, right? I'll just leave that in you. Now you can uh, have fun with that. 
What else? What else we got? A nice, uh, I don't know what this is. Uh, the uh, proper term for this is it's like an axe uh, with a, I don't know. <laughs> I've never really worked on a farm or done any gardening, so some of these tools might be a little foreign to me. I mean, I have a VR headset. <laughs> you think the uh, number one thing in my life would be farming tools? You know, it's not really uh, got a uh, whatever this thing is. <laughs> oh man, I should ask my mom. She does all the gardening. So yeah, we got that thing, and we've got a uh, tiny rake, I guess. Call this a rake? Is this a rake? I don't know. But it's going to go in this guy's back. There you go. Alright, so what else we got? A sickle. I, I, I know this. This is for cutting down uh, grass, right? right? Come back to those uh, broadswords in a little bit. I need to find somebody. Oh, here we go. This guy right here. I have a Oh, oh, come on. Stick in. There we go. These guys are like pin cushions. You know, you just... <laughs> Let me just make sure I'm not hitting the edges of my play space here. Pretty bad when you hit the wall. Got some broad swords. All right. Let's put this in. Oh, with uh, some of the uh, tools, you have to hold the trigger down for to, to grab them and keep holding it down to keep grabbing them or else they just fly out of your hands so one thing you gotta watch out for stabbing that's nice got slicing and dicing oh yep all there pretty good oh well no but didn't get him i'll get him later boom nice uh, little uh well, it's not a claymore. Is that what the uh, Highlander uses? Claymore? I'm not, again, I don't know much about uh, bladed weapons, so you'll have to excuse my ignorance. Uh, yeah, some cool stuff there. Two ones, which I'm not really going to use because, I mean, you know, you get the idea. They're good for stabbing, good for uh, bashing some heads in, and they're good for cutting. Which, they don't have the sounds yet, huh? There's no ching, ching, metal on metal. I guess that's a more realistic metal on metal sound, huh? I don't know. Like I said, I don't know much about swords. But I do know one thing about, uh, <laughs> I, do, I do know one melee weapon. And that, where is that? Evil. Ha, there it is. The fabled katana folded. A thousand times and cut steel like butter. <laughs> yes. So, um, again, Anton said that he, uh, I think, worked on most, if not all, of the melee weapons. So I'm hoping that this was one of them. But uh, just because it's funny, you know, you're carrying a katana around, it's humorous. So let's see. Got no. Wait, hold on. Oh. Tell me I got stabbing in here. Oh, I need someone that's standing pretty good. Okay. No. No, not yet. Oh, no, there's still no... Uh... Maybe I'm not doing it right. Hold on. I need to hold two-handed. Make sure I'm not hitting a wall here. Let me... Uh... against this guy. <laughs> do a little, uh... do a little stance that they do in those, uh... you know... Those movies, right? No. Yep. So not all the weapons have uh, the uh, new properties to them. Kind of, uh, it's kind of sad, but hey, you know what? He's only one man. Can't blame him for not working on all the weapons. Oh, let's see. Um, Elam or the Pylum, I forgot what it's called. Those are the thrown weapons. Uh, let's see, what else? Farm tools. 
think you got everything. No, you can't stab with a broom, can you? That'd be funny. Oh no. You glitched out on me there. This does light damage. Oh, well. <laughs> That's pretty deadly. Oh, wait a minute. What's going on here? Why is my controller all the way down there? I guess if you wanted to push them away, you know, like, uh, get out of here. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can <laughs> you can also sweep. We'll clean up the place. All right, yeah. This guy's still, uh, these guys are all uh, <laughs> in horrible pain for what I've done to them. So let's put them out of their misery. I wonder if the drill works now. I mean, you know, like, you'd think, you know, there'd be a stabbing property with a drill, but I don't really think so. Come, on. Come here. No, just makes them explode. That's too bad, but you know what, like I said, he's only one, one man. He can't really, uh, can't really fault him for that. That's a little more complex right there, the drill. All right, got some goofy stuff. Uh, I don't think those are uh, working yet. Just those uh, those items on the table, and maybe some some of the uh, some of the other stuff here. I wonder if the cleaver will. No, uh, maybe not. Well, actually, let me the still got some sausage standing around, not doing anything. Oh, I ran into him with a knife or meat cleaver. No, it doesn't stick. It should stick. You ever uh, used a meat cleaver on some uh, some carcass? You know, you're chopping it up. Kind of tends to stick in there when you're cooking. <laughs> I'm not a serial killer. I promise you that. <laughs> I'm talking about meat on the kitchen table. Okay, that's what I mean. All right. This, yeah, that, that just makes me even more suspicious, right? Now let's just let's just forget about that. Oh yeah, we got the uh, shields now. Hand grenade shield. Hey, oh, forgot about this. This was a, uh, I think this was a uh, Rot Wieners um, exclusive item. The old one, not the new one. Um, yeah, that's cool. Anyways, we got some guys over there that are. Um, in terrible pain and uh, some that are probably have PTSD from me shoving all sorts of farm tools and implements and bladed weapons in them so I'm gonna put them out of their misery let's see what should I choose what is good man again we're back to this problem too many guns in this game I can't decide which one I like oh man hmm the carbine carbine whatever you want to call it no maybe a shotgun magazine fed hmm oh the scalpel that's pretty good Just, uh, well, you know what that's a little too damaging right there <laughs> those are the uh there's this flag 12 high explosive Let's not use that one. Let's uh, go with. Let's see, where is that? Whoa. Little gauge. Let's just go with a regular buckshot. Time to put these guys out the pasture. They're all feeling a little bit of a thing from all these uh, weapons in them. The life of a Sausig. All they have to all they have to look forward to is to endure pain. I'm just doing them a service. <laughs> that sounds even worse. Oh great. Now I sound like a really bad person. Buddy. Come 
Last guy. Nice knowing you. Oh wait, <laughs> that's just a head. I really like this shotgun. It's really nice, even though it's fictional. Alright, so uh, I think that should be it for today. I don't know how many minutes I've been recording. Let me just check here. Oh, 30 minutes. Wow. Long time. Just me messing around. It doesn't feel that long, but uh, yeah. So that should be it. Uh, I was I, I said earlier I was going to play some other modes with the, uh, with the new melee weapons, but uh, wow. This has been an exhausting uh, session of H3VR, so I'm going to stop and sit down and stop the recording. See you guys next time.